Hello guys. Uh today I'm uh I just got a harmonist PS6. The boss made really good good pedal. So this is a uh, very close to Digitech Wami pedal, like uh, whatever Digitech Wami you know. So this is very close, uh, and you can compare this with uh, any latest uh, Digitech Wami pedal or like any kind of like a uh, electro harmonist has a uh, that a uh, folk tone or something like that. That this is one of the uh, I really love this pedal. I initially I got this pedal. I was not sure how good this pedal is. So and I was checking online. So thought like let's make a video compare with the Digitech Wami pedal. I've been using Digitech Wami for almost like five six years, and now I got to into this. This kind of small pedal, but it works as good as. Uh, Maybe I say better than this day wine battle. I've been using this day wine for almost six years, five, six years now, almost six years. But uh, this battle, I found really, I'm impressed with this battle. So I'm making a demo uh, on PS6 Harmonist. And the, this, is, this is from the boss. So here, so before, uh, if you are buying this battle, like, you know, I got this for you. So normally this battle costs around 149 dollars for the brand new if you go in the market uh, but I got this one used from the one I used store I paid like 80 bucks which uh, which is way way cheaper compared to a Digitech wine battle the Digitech wine battle costs around 220 for like uh, around something around almost like two, 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 220 something like that for the brand new, even if you get a used Digitech Wami, you might get that around 150, 160 like that. But I got this used one for 80 bucks, and which, which works perfectly. And the uh, the other benefit of this, having this paddle is this paddle is, is like small, like a, a same size of any other boss paddle. Whereas uh, Digitech Wami is kind of big and heavy, so you're gonna add up, you're gonna add the weight on your paddle board. So I, I I save like a I, when I change this to like from this take Wami pedal to this boss PS6, so you know I got extra space in my pedal board. So that's the reason I love this. Uh, I'm 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 in love. I'm liking this pedal. So I'm gonna do the quick demo. Uh, how this is close to the uh, this take Wami pedal, and uh, I'm gonna compare and and what are the benefit it has over the Digitech Wami battle all right so here so i'm gonna start like i'm gonna start with the every functionality on this battle so uh, i have connected the input from my guitar to input and the output from a to my marshall amp so here it has option to have a like expression paddle so i was gonna tell you about that part so and it has a output a and b so b is basically like the effect sound like me or dry sound like if you put just in the a like it will come uh, both in the a so you can work with the um, mono or stereo uh, doesn't matter uh, so let me start with this uh, uh, first first functionality right so we have the major minor functionality there's a different mode right so here this is a major mi this is like a major right now is on a major this is a minor and this is a pitch shifter this is a due tune and it has a s band s band is basically like a, a super band all right is like a is 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 i'm gonna show you like this is like wine battle so uh let me do the let me do the, let me go through uh go over the major and minor mode like basically what we have the major and minor mode right here is basically uh we you select the har harmony like what kind of harmony do you want the the uh, uh uh, when we like when I'm doing the harmony like you know this one has like three harmony we have like three voice harmony whereas the Digitech Wami does not have that three voice harmony it has like two voice harmony um, and you can select the key or uh, you can and then Digitech Wami like uh, you cannot select the key so I like uh, this is one of the features that I like about it if you are playing in the major key of C this and then you can you can select the harmony and also guys like uh, before if you're uh, getting this battle you can go to the like uh, google search and search for ps6 uh, manual all right if you download the ps6 manual like it will tell you all the stuff um it, i have downloaded i have printed and downloaded the stuff 
it's gonna look like this so this is a harmony part right here so uh, how it gonna work so i'm gonna go through the harmony part right now so the harmony part right here basically uh you select the key and you select major or minor all right and you want to select uh you want to select the three harmony part or like two harmony part like whatever harmony so in order to know what which like uh, what is the selection for every harmony so you better always go to the uh, download the manual for ps6 so this is what i downloaded from the ps6 all right i bought the used one so they, it didn't come uh it didn't come with the manual book so so you can download all these downloads so see right here so this is basically the harmony part right here so it will tell you like see if you if you put on the uh, on the on the top one there's a third harmony so that is uh, it comes with like uh with the natural uh, sound and the third harmony so uh, uh this one if you go to the 11 o'clock this is the minus third like it goes to down third harmony and the natural one that's minus six is minus six harmony with a, a natural one so minus one that is like one octave down and here is a plus one is one octave up that's a harmony right so the, this is a this is a like the the one which you see the orange part right here so this is where the three harmony part uh, looks like so this is a fourth a minus four a minus four and minus six include uh, with the natural natural sound like original sound see a plus one and minus one like one octave high one one octave down with the original sound so there's three harmony part so same with the third and minus four with an uh, with the original sound third and fifth with the original sound so this is how the harmony works all right and uh, when you select the harmony so let me uh, let me select this harmony let's say this is, is a major and let's do the c all right for the simple like let's do uh this is the uh as for like i am right now in 12 o'clock so 12 o'clock right here is the third harmony so it's third harmony and the natural sound so let me turn it on so all right so when you turn, turn it off so this is sound natural sound that's an open string uh six uh, six string open string that, that's a e so right so this is like when you do the like the balance right here more you move to this side this and uh, this is the original sound of the guitar right original sound it doesn't make, make a difference when you turn it off on it doesn't make a difference over here so when you turn this side so this is a more effect like uh, this is the effect sound so right now we are in the third harmony right natural and third harmony so you're gonna see only the third harmony see this uh, natural sound off that's on that's the third harmony so when you put it in the balances is a, is a balance out like so you hear both natural harmony as well as the third harmony all right so this is how it works so if you are playing in the c major all right so c major so that's that's um, how you play the c major so like that's how you play that like depending on the sound like when you play the solo or, or like how, how, what, what is the key you're playing like if you're playing the minor so you just move this one to minor all right so that's a minor c minor So like it depends on the key, all right. So let me show you the how the how is this uh, uh, third third harmony. I'm gonna do the third harmony. Uh, let me do the third harmony uh, right here. Third and the fifth, all right. Third and the fifth, which is all the way like second position from the right. Like this is the third harmony. So there's a three harmony on this one right so basically this is a harmony part so we have the let's go to the pitch swift uh pitch sector right the pitch sector is like is also like a harmony but um uh, in the pitch sector this key doesn't work so this key doesn't work in uh pitch sector so basically we have to work with this one and the, the balance and the shift sit now all right so it's same 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 like like you go to the manual right here so pitch shift basically it gives you the uh, like a, like two two note actually two note. So here is a again the pitch shifting map. So it's a plus third and the natural harmony. It's pretty much same like a harmony, but like it's a, it, it it produces a, a dual a dual sound. Pitch uh, shifter is basically uh, is the same sound, right? So basically like uh the way we have uh, in the um, you know like a half step down and half like like th this one this is one octave down and here we have one octave uh, up all right this is what i mostly use so
so this is uh, in three o'clock and this is a nine o'clock all right so let's do nine o'clock sorry this is nine o'clock and this this uh, this knob doesn't work on this one i'm in the piece shift all right so see this one is a one octave down so this is a this is a natural sound when you turn it off on it doesn't, doesn't make any difference all right so let me turn it on and let's go to the one octave down so this is one octave down so this is effect one so this is effect one so i normally put like here so you can you can play the bass like like bassy sound like This is uh, how you play the play the bass like whatever sound you uh, used to get like a, you know one octave down in the whammy so this is what this is what you get a one octave down and you want how much effect you want so this is this is a uh, this is sound. so in the uh, this take you don't have an option to choose like how much effect do you want right so this is basically you want a very one octave down like little bit a uh, natural sound with a one down so this is this is like 50 50 so this is like 75% of the effect and effect effect sound and the like 25% of the natural sound. So this is like 100% effect sound. So basically I pull it right here. So this is how uh, like you play the bass or like if you want to go to one octave up. So basically it's like in the nine o'clock, right? How you gonna select a uh, similarly like we say that if you download the manual right so it manual always says like this is plus seven uh, harmony like the minus minus five like a five, uh, five fifth down harmony uh, normally i use a uh, one octave down up down like this, the three o'clock is down uh three o'clock is down nine o'clock is up so whatever piece shifter like you want to use like this is what you're going to use uh, so we're going to go to the so we have the detune now so detune is basically you just slightly you shift the note whatever note you're gonna play you slightly you shift the note like even in the due to this uh, uh, the key knob doesn't work so we have the shift and the balance so uh, you know if you see the manual book uh, in the manual book um, what it says is it has like five cents plus ten cents of uh, like five cents basically around like maybe five percent slightly uh, like like a change five percent change sound in uh, on top of the original sound so if you have a five cent that is like five cent little higher than the original note M uh, minus five that is a little lower down the original sound like plus is like little like uh, you know ten percent of uh like a ten ten percent of the original sound up and down like you know like you go down or like you go to high so basically I use this sound just like literally like um, you know for the for the rhythm part or you can use for uh, both rhythm as well as the uh, solo part but I use I love this uh, detune sound for the uh, 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 rhythm part like when you play the rhythm like uh, uh, any kind of rhythm let me show you this one so here I'm gonna I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do here uh, the five cents all right or let me do the plus ten which is uh, one o'clock uh, that is a plus ten so this is one o'clock right here let me do uh, this one here so this uh, one doesn't work on this one so this is a plus 10 uh, and by, like 50 50 on the effect right so this is kind of, it's kind of little fuzzy because there is a slightly change the detune is like like slightly change very slightly change all right so if you check turn, turn it off it is natural so this is a clean clean original sound if you turn it on so a little fuzzy, like it's like a chorus, like but but like it sounds really good with the with the uh, with the chord, right? So when you're playing the chord, like this is one of the best one you can uh, you can uh, you can use this one. I really love it actually, the tune one. So uh, similarly, you have like plus twenty, minus twenty, plus ten, minus ten. So uh, the uh, and when uh, we have right here at seven or eight o'clock and the uh, four o'clock and five o'clock. So this is like same like a third harmony like three sound all right so when you do like a, uh no actually plus or minus this is like seven o'clock uh and the five o'clock these are like this yeah these are like three harmony uh so let's do all the way right here so you will see th uh, so there's like this sound right here is a plus 10 minus 10 uh, which is like a slight like original uh, like uh, the effect sound is like slightly uh, 10 percent higher and 10 percent lower drop the drop sound from the original sound that's what you're gonna see so 
So you use basically like a very slight change. And if you turn it off, this is the original one. So this is if, if it works. It's like a, it's like cor, uh, like, cor, cor, like same like chorus sound, but like yeah, it is like there's like is a harm like is like there's a harmony on it, all right? So it, it good for the rhythm part. And we have the super band. This is a, something like I really love it. Super band, S band, what we have right here. So in S band we have that like all this pedal works, all right? And similarly, if you go to the manual book in S S band, so S band has like this like it has a, like you know when you compare this uh, super band compared to uh, one e digitech paddle digitech paddle does not have like you know three octave or four octave up down like this like four octave higher sound you can make from this boss paddle ps6 uh, whereas the uh, digitech one does not have this plus three or minus uh, plus three it has a minus three it has a plus four so some this is something like new um like this is something additional feature we have in the boss compared to this tech whammy so let me show you the plus one and plus two octave uh, in uh, first and i will show you wh what what how this is this is plus one plus two and minus one minus two so this is what you have in the this tech so i'm gonna show you that one so let me do the uh, this uh, 12 o'clock is a plus one uh plus one means like one octave higher and uh, 11 o'clock is like one octave down so uh, one octave higher right so this is the effect pedal right here so here what is what we have is like this is rise time and the fall time so if you have super pain this is like the, uh, this pedal like when it's so this is what happens so see this is rise time fall time so that, that's how you want to add this so if you want to uh, like uh, if, if you want to have a rise time like very quick so you decrease this one and the fall time if you want to do fall time slow so this see this is a fall time I, I made it fall time very like a uh, very slow right so you increase this fall time so this fall time is very slow like if you want to do fall time really quick so so if you want to do a rise time very lo low Like it takes time to to reach to the high note right so if you want to do like both high it takes time and you release it so it doesn't turn on and off automatically right so you have to have like like if you want to play the like a stone solo the one uh, uh, on the like a stone like has uh plus high octave uh, like this is uh, one o'clock is a uh, uh two octave up uh so this is a uh, Right time, so something it has to be right here, and even the right time, fall time, both has to be around ten or eleven o'clock. All right. So this is how. So this is what we're gonna use. So this is this is this is this uh, setting is perfect for like stone solo, right? All right. So this is the what exactly solo you uh, you can use this one for uh, for the S band. So this is the rise time, this is fall time, and this is um, harmony. All right. So uh, same way uh, we have the three three harmony mode. You can select the three harmony mode right here. Wow. Wow. And it, it has like a three o'clock is a four harmony, right? So if you go to the three o'clock is a four a four a four octave higher actually four sorry four octave higher than three o'clock. <laughs> So you don't have this feature in a digital whammy, all right? And if a three o'clock is a like a, a, a three octave down, see the like down. So basically, this is what we have. And additionally, we if you want to use the expression paddle, so you can use the expression paddle, and uh, you, uh, like the expression paddle will work exactly. And the S pen like it doesn't turn it on. Like you have to press it, and if you release it, it come back, all right? All right, guys. Like this is what uh, like I'm trying to make it uh, more detailed, but the video is getting longer. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it and you're gonna like this one video. All right, hope to see you in next video. Bye bye. <laughs>